Hi everyone and welcome to the overview on Connect and how to become registered in Connect with a seamless process through Blackboard. Very simple. Let's take a look. So McGraw-Hill Connect is a web-based assignment and assessment platform. We talked about that in the orientation power, uh, presentation. It gives students means to better connect with their coursework, instructors, and important concepts. It makes managing and receiving assignments easier, it improves your students' success, and you can access Connect anytime, anywhere, because it's web-based. So, how do I register? How do you get started? You don't go to a web address in Connect. You actually log in to Blackboard. Log into your campus Blackboard account using your personal login and password. Now you'll select the course from your Blackboard menu that we want to work in. So you're going to select Accounting 410 Auditing. Select the folder that contains your course assignments. Now this is a little different than um, for us because I do things a little differently than other instructors. So in your orientation folder, there is a link to connect. Click on that. And here's what happens. When you select that assignment in the Blackboard orientation folder, it's going to try to connect, not, not a pun, but it's trying to access the Connect website. It's going to say, whoa, you're not registered for this course. So it says McGraw-Hill Connect registration is required. Once you register, you'll never have to do anything with Connect again. So to get started, click register now or sign in on the next page. So click continue. So it's going to welcome you to connect. It's going to confirm the course information and then you'll click on register now. Now, they're going to ask you for your email address. If you have already had a McGraw-Hill account so if you've used Connect for another course in the past, use that email address you've used in the past and it will ask you for your password. You won't have to create a new account. But if this is the first time you've um, been using McGraw-Hill, you'll go through a registration process, giving you an email, password, a security question. Then you'll come to the student registration. How do I register? Well, there's three different ways. One, you already have an access code that was packaged with your book. Enter it on the left-hand side under, I have, have a registration code. Enter it exactly as you see it. The other, buy an online access code. So you could purchase it right there using a credit card. You don't have an access code, nor can you buy it at this point you could start a free trial. I think they give you up to two weeks free trial for free, but then you must have permanent access. Please know that if you use the free trial, it's like you have permanent access as far as the work you complete. When you do gain permanent access, it, it's seamless. It, it, it's like you were always in a permanent access. So all your grades will be recorded in Blackboard and you won't have to do anything extra, just put the access code in. Now we're taking you through the process of purchasing the Connect um, for the course. So you would just click Buy Connect. Ours is Connect. And they probably want to know some information about the school. Then you'll need to fill out a registration form if necessary, if you need to create an account. If you already had an account, you would be in there um, using your password that you had in your prior Connect course. Now you're finished with your registration. Please make sure to click on Go to Connect Now to complete your registration and continue to your instructor's course. So don't just stop there. Finish the process. You are now at your instructor's course. 
This is where you can access your assignments and study resources. Once you are finished with your assignment, you can quickly return to Blackboard course by clicking on the Return to Blackboard link. That's your registration. That's as easy as it is. You never have to independently access Connect Again. Now you will just click on your assignments in Blackboard and it will automatically take you and you should have no problems. Unless you took the free trial, they'll remind you you're still under free trial and that the um, expiration date will be arriving soon. So please make sure you get that permanent access. If you have issues with purchasing a, a um, access code for extreme reasons beyond your control, please contact me. If you need help or have any questions, there's the information for the Connect customer support, the phone numbers, and times of operations. So that is how you register. Please get registered as soon as possible. Email me with questions.